Hello friends, today let's solve redundant connection 2. This problem has a slight difference from the redundant connection 1. In this question, the graph is directed. So, in the ages list, if given age is 1, 2, that means there is an age from node 1 to node 2. But in redundant uh, connection 1, uh, the edges are undir undirected, so that means there is an edge between node 1 and 2. So let's see two examples. The first example, one, uh, there is an edge between from 1 to 2, and uh, there is an edge from 1 to 3. There is an edge from 2 to 3. So this graph is not a rooted uh, tree. Why? Because for the node 3, it has a two parent node. So that means we can remove one of these two h. But actually, we will return to 2, 3. Why? Because it says, if there are multiple answers, return the answer that occurs last in the given 2D array. So we just return 2, 3. So this is another example. Why we will remove this 4, 2, 1? Because this 4H, it, uh, ha it uh, forms a cycle. So we need to remove the last H, which is 4, 1. Okay. So if we just use the same algorithm as the Mm, 684, which is an undirected graph, we just need to detect a cycle and uh, return the last edge, but it will cause some problems. Let's see this example. If this is the given edges, 2, 2, 1, 3, 2, 1, 4, 2, 2, 1, 2, 4, uh, let's see. How it uh, how does it uh, violate uh, rules? Rules. As for the node one, it has two parents, which is two and three. So we can remove one of these edge edges, and for this part, it uh, forms a cycle. So we can remove one of these three edges. So in order to break these two violations we need uh, to remove the overlap edge which which is the two two one so we just uh, return two two one so how can we form the solution algorithm we can first uh, actually we can take use of the algorithm from uh 684 we first need to count each node see whether it has um two in in degrees, if it had two in degrees, it, there, it is another story. If it does not have two in degrees, our, uh, we just need to detect cycle. So this is the simplest uh, case. If all nodes only have one deg in degree, we just uh, need to detect cycle, which is exactly the same algorithm as the previous question. If uh, there is a node that has two edges, if we remove that edge, let's see the rest. The rest part, uh, whether it does not has a cycle. If it does not has a cycle, then that edge is what we have to remove. If we remove that edge, like this edge, that still has cycle, then this is not the answer. If we remove this edge, the rest part does not have a cycle. Then we just return it. So okay. To solve this question, um, but you should notice that uh, we have to start from n minus one because we want to always remove the last edge in the edge list. So we need a disjoint set. Uh, this is for detect cycle. And we will use this data structure in this function. And this skip age is, for example, in this case, we skip this age, see whether rest part has a cycle or not. Okay, 
So now let's write the code. We first need a DSU. We need a size for the rank. Um, for the I mean for the optimization merge. I think it's union by rank. And uh, for the root, which means uh, every node, what is it? What uh, is its root uh, node? So we first need to write a constructor function, which we call the public uh, DSU. We will pass n, and uh, then the size will new int n plus one. Why? Because you will see the node is from one to n. But uh, by default, uh, the range is from 0 to a minus 1, so we just uh, plus 1. And uh, for the root, uh, it is n plus 1. And uh, we should uh, initialize this size to 1. At first, uh, every connected component only has size uh, 1 node. It is, it is itself. And uh, for each um, for each uh, node, it uh, its root it is self, is it self? So it I. Okay, then we need to write uh, find, and here we will use pass compression for every node. If uh, its node is not uh, itself. We will let all the nodes in its path to the final root, to the final root. So it is called path compression. Find the root x, and finally just return root x. How about uh, the union? What is the return type? Actually, it varies in different uh, problems. In this problem, we should uh, return a boolean, a boolean value. Why? Because we will see whether we can union these two nodes, x, y. So we'll first get root x, which is find x, and the root y, which is find y. If uh, root x equal to root y, we just uh, return false, because we cannot uh, union these two nodes. If uh, not the same, we will compare the size. If uh, size root x less than size root y, then we let uh, this subtree um, attach to a subtree of the root x to the subtree of root y. So size root y will uh, add up the size root x and uh, the root uh, root uh, x will equal to root y I else the size root uh, x will add up size root uh, y and the uh, root uh, root y will equal to root x and uh, if we can union them then we return true okay so now let's write the detect uh, cycle will return an h so it is int array detect cycle. We shall pass n, and we also need to pass this ages list. We also need to pass a skip h. So we will new a uh, disjoint set. The size is n, and we iterate all the ages. If uh, the arrays equals e equal to the skip h we just uh, continue otherwise if uh, we cannot union these two dsu union this two node if we cannot union it that means uh, they forms a cycle so we just uh, return this h Otherwise, in the end, we just return none. That means there is no cycle in current uh, graph. Okay, so here we will 
get n equal to ages dot length and uh, we need a array we call it uh, in degrees and the size is also n plus one and we will see whether there is a node has two in degrees so it has two in degrees at first equal to negative one then we iterate all the edges okay then we let in degrees of the e1 plus plus if the in degrees e1 equal to 2 that means this node has two in degrees so has two in degrees mm will equal to this node and uh, we just uh, break we find it we will not have another node okay so now we start okay we will first check if the has two in degrees equal to negative one we just uh, return the detect cycle which is an and uh, ages and uh, skip age we do not need to skip age so we just uh, pass now if uh, there is a node that has two in degrees we start from i equal to n minus one i great or equal than zero i minus minus so if current uh, i equal to uh, sorry the ages i one equal to the has two if it has two in degrees what should we do we will try to remove it see if whether the rest of the graph has no cycle if uh, detect cycle function which is n and the uh, ages the skip age is current uh, ages i if it uh, equal to now it does not has a cycle we just uh, return this ages i but in the end we should uh, write a fake return um statement Joint uh, mm, union. Oh, sorry. That should be E one. Mm, in degrees. Okay. Thank you for watching. See you next time.